A great retaliation, honestly, that was a bath of cold water for everyone. Hello friends, before we start, subscribe to the channel and activate the bell. Let's go to the news. San Diego Padres star Fernando Tatis Jr. has been linked to a sensational move to the New York Yankees as they look to trade punches with the rival New York Mets. The Yankees may have rehired the most desirable player in MLB after they agreed to bring Aaron Judge back to Yankee Stadium. But they're not done there and are eager to let their close rivals know that they're not the only team that can afford to make big deals. The Mets have the richest owner in MLB, with Steve Cohen worth about 12.25 billion pounds, $15.5 billion, and they haven't wasted any time on the trade market ahead of the new season. But the Yankees are making sure they are at full strength as well. Judge's hiring ended rumors that he might join the San Francisco Giants, with the Yankees desperate not to let their valuable asset leave. Judge was awarded the MVP of the 2022 season and even broke the American League record for home runs. Judge signed a nine-year, £293 million, $360 million contract to remain with the Yankees, but there are rumors that they could soon move for Tatis Jr. That's according to radio host Rick DiPietro, who thinks the Yankees are feeling the pressure to add more faces after rehiring Judge. The host said on DiPietro and Rothenberg's show on ESPN, I don't care what they say, Hal Steinbrenner has to be feeling pressure right now with what Steve Cohen is doing. I'll tell you what I heard over the weekend, since the Yankees are on to something big. I heard Tatis Jr. over the weekend. Hiring Tatis Jr. may be a big statement, but it's not completely out of the question either. The Padres just agreed to sign Xander Bogaerts from the Boston Red Sox and could trade him instead of moving him elsewhere in the outfield. Tatis Jr. still has a suspension for performance-enhancing drugs, which means he will miss games at the start of the 2023 season. Tatis Jr. will be eligible to return in mid-April, but he is also coming back from wrist and shoulder surgeries. The 23-year-old has signed a long-term contract with the Padres, but his annual salary is not over the top right now and could be a good investment for the Yankees. He is only expected to earn 5.7 million pounds, $7 million, in 2023, and while that will increase in the future, he may be worth more by then. That was the video, my friends. I ask you to subscribe to the channel and leave your like.